Welcome to Linus Tech Tips at CES 2013. Our trip to the show this year is powered by Corsair, maker of quality PC components and peripherals. Our trusted storage partner is Seagate Technology, and our trusted networking partner is Linksys. At the Sony booth, they've got what looks to me like a fairly compelling demo here. So I've heard the argument that you can't really tell the difference between 1080p and 4K. And while at a very sort of far away distance, that much may be true. And while these may be a little bit exaggerated because they're 86 inch televisions, which I think most people aren't running, bear in mind guys, you can already get a 55 inch TV for around that thousand dollar price point. So this could be sooner than you think. So check this out. You may have to zoom in in order to make the point uh, from the camera's perspective. We've got Slick operating the camera, of course. So the... All right, so the 4K TV is on our left. From a distance of, I guess I must be about two meters away, I can comfortably read text in something like a newspaper article. However, on the 1080p version, the text has a lot of interpolation, so it's very, very difficult to read. So. If the point that we're trying to make is that it's sharper, especially for a static image, then point taken, Sony. It's hard to say how much of a difference you'll be able to tell in a full motion video, especially because as 4K content gets more popular, we might not see, uh, well, as 4K equipment is much more expensive than 1080p equipment, we're gonna have limitations in terms of the frame rates we can capture at. So, sports, we're probably looking at 1080p for the foreseeable future. However, for, things, uh, for anything shot like, you know, cityscapes and you know beautiful nature stuff animals 4k should make an impact don't miss any of our ces 2013 coverage subscribe to linus tech tips thanks for watching linus tech tips at ces 2013 powered by corsair seagate technology and linksys